My name is Rich Lair. I'm the innovation coordinator at a school called Brookwood School in Manchester by the Sea, Massachusetts. Yeah, so my son Max was born in uh, 2010 with a condition called Symbrachydactyly, um, and that prevented the fingers on his right hand from, from forming. When he was three years old or so, I came across a video put together by a gentleman by the name of Richard Van Az and Ivan Owen, and they had created the first 3D printable prosthetic, and I realized that might make an awesome project for my eighth grade students. This hand is a hand that was built by eighth graders at our school. That moment when he put it on and was able to pick things up with his hand for the first time in his life, uh, that was fairly transformative, certainly for Max, certainly for my students, and um, probably more importantly for me, uh, it was transformative for me and kind of pivoted my whole professional career and my uh, relationship with my son and, and his relationship with kids in his community. I think that's one of the times when I really realized the power of, of Tinkercad. That idea that a kid can go from idea to actual solution in, in a very short period of time, like that is incredibly powerful. So one thing that we're trying to do is get our students to look through their school through Max's eyes uh, with his upper limb difference, what sorts of things might he have difficulties with. And that's pretty cool because those kids feel like they are in some deep actual engineering authentic problem solving there because they know that if they can kind of crack that nut and get a system that works that only won't work for max's hand but we could do this for every kid that has an upper limb difference so we're, we're working towards that